another unboxing kasi most of you requested that we do more unboxing in this channel eh, but um, this unboxing will also involve watches if in the last video in the last unboxing we did the moon swatch by the collaboration of swatch and omega now we're going to do the Seiko 5 GMT watches these are actually Seiko watches and not the wallet na maswerte <laughs> These are very um, in demand nowadays. In fact, ang um, haba ng listahan, kailangan mo magpalista para makakuha ng mga to. We got these from resellers but um, we chose resellers that uh, offer this for a price not that far from the retail price. The retail price is just around the $300 mark. So it's very reasonably priced. It looks good. It's nice. And um, the mechanism and the technology used for it is actually very reliable. And thus, uh, watch enthusiasts and collectors are impressed with these and hence the supply issue. These are the S. SK005 and the SSK003 these are actually from two different resellers but both of them got their supply from at Tokyo store which is a Japanese store located in most malls in the Philippines one came from Daet Sur, if I'm not mistaken and the other one is just I think here in Metro Manila so let's proceed with the unboxing let's unbox first the SK, SSK 005. The box is just like this. Um, it's just carton. Um, mura lang siya, so <laughs> you don't expect it to be the like the luxury watches packaging. Um, so sa loob, ano rin siya? Carton din siya, pero mas matigas na carton. And then of course the the manual and the warranty card are inside the the box. Um, once you open it, it's very simple, and there you have the SSK005, which is actually orange. While we do the unboxing, let's enumerate the reasons why the Seiko 5 GMT is so popular. So the Seiko 5 range was introduced in the 1960s, presenting five key points of the collection. The day and date complication, which is this portion. The in-house automatic movement. Which is that portion. You'll see the um, movement at the back of the watch. Um, these models of the Seiko 5 are actually water resistant. Um, the excellent steel cases. And the recessed crown at the 4 o'clock. Seiko 5 is known for its reliability and minimal maintenance and very affordable prices. This new Seiko 5 GMT is part of the Seiko 5 Sports Collection and while the diameter is actually 42.5 millimeters, because of the compact 46.5 lug-to-lug -lug measurement, the actual wear and comfort feels like a 40 to 41 millimeter watch. The effect is that there is a presence in the watch when you wear when you wear it, but it doesn't appear oversized. So, ito. Subukan natin. This is actually not mine. So, medyo maluwag siya sa akin. Pero, astig pa rin yung kulay. At saka yung forma, di ba? So, yan. Lapit ko. So, actually, yung color niya is orange yung face niya. Pero itong dial, outer dial niya, actually, is the upper portion is actually black. Pero, etong sa ilalim niya is actually black na nagiging gray in some angles. Can you see? It's actually gray. Nagiging black minsan, depende sa angle, sa lighting, pero nagiging gray siya kapag iba rin yung angle. Ah, ganda. Ano, barin ko muna. Okay, that, so that's the SSK005. 005 is the orange one, while the 003 is the blue one. There's also a 001, which is actually the black one. Right? Um, the water resistance of these watches is rated at 100 meters, which is sufficient for most non-diver users. Uh, as I've said, uh, playful colors, especially for the blue and orange models, um, because the bezel inserts are bicolor. Bezel inserts pala ang tawag dito. 
sa ganito. Um, black and gray on the black and orange models, which are the SSK005 and the SSK001, and blue and black on the blue dial version, which is the SSK003. So, ganun din yung box niya. Nagay ko muna dito yung box niya. So, karton din na matigas, but this time it's blue. Ito akin to. <laughs> yung isa kasi kay Ranji yung orange. So, this is the blue one. So, parehong-pareho rin siya actually, nung orange. Except the color, of course. And ito, yung papansin nyo, blue yung ilalim. And black yung ibabaw. Kita nyo sa ibang angles ng kuha at saka ng lighting. Black sa taas, blue sa ilalim. Ganda rin o, oh. suit ko. The finishing, craftsmanship, and heft of the watch is amazing for a sub $500 watch. As I've said, it's just around $300. And the bracelet is Jubilee style, if you've noticed. It's Jubilee style. And um, it's equipped with a folding clasp and secure lock. So, ito yung likod. Hindi ko napakita sa inyo yung likod. So, hindi lang siya ganyan. Meron pa siya dito. So, may clasp siya dyan. Tapos, pag bubuksan nyo siya, angat nyo lang yung clasp. And then, meron pa siyang ipipress mo dito. And then, it will open like that. Okay? So, ganda, di ba? Mura lang, pero maganda. Tapos, um, ano pa, yung feel pa nung watch very secure very elegant, maganda maganda ang dating ng dalawang watches na to okay? so kung gusto yung bumili ng ganito may mga resellers just like yung mga nagbenta sa amin nito kasi sila yung mga nauna sa pila sa Tokyo and they ordered 001, 003 and 005 and they decide to sell one of the uh, the watches that they got so kung gusto nyo naman kung ayaw nyo magdagdag ng kaunti yung kaunti meaning mga 1,000 peso siguro papalista kayo sa Tokyo and then tatawagan naman kayo kapag meron ng stocks pero usually 5 five ano lang ang 5 uh, stocks lang ang dumarating every month so matagal-tagal na pilahan 